Hello my soccer universe, I'm still not done with the weekend reviews and I have to haul my national team traverses out and then I said okay let's start with the first draw that happened because before the weekend we had a Nations League draw with a World Cup draw so I'm gonna cover these now in separate videos and then we'll go back to reviewing with the league action. It's just a little bit annoying to have these draws now when the games are being played so late. So Nations League first. The final tournament will be played in Italy, which uh, kind of was already pre-decided. Um, but um, we have to, of course, take that into account. And it's uh, played in Milan and in Turin. So that makes it definitely interesting. But before we have those, we have also the relegation playouts for League C. So who is going to go down to League D? Um, the dates have not been 100% confirmed, but we know that Moldova will have first a home game on the 24th and 25th of March against Kazakhstan and then playing on the 28th or 29th away. And same dates for Estonia against Cyprus. Estonia first at home, then Cyprus uh, will have the home game and the loser on the aggregate will be uh, going down to League D. But let's go all the way up to the uh, Nations League Finals, which curiously will be played in October, which I also thought, I mean, you could have at least made that the uh, four teams in the relegation playoffs can only have to go in groups with the uh, Final Four and it's a little bit more, but whatever. Uh, we got actually, I mean, if you're an Italy fan, this was probably the draw that you were hoping for. The, Italy has a decent chance to make it to the final and that the two big teams, Belgium and France, are playing at each other in the other semi-final. Italy plays at home to Spain in Milan. It's not a foregone conclusion, but um, as, as we'll see, my model then favors Italy over Spain. And then Belgium will play France, where Belgium is also uh, slightly favored over France. The winners will play the final in Milan on the 10th of October and just um, before that we have in Turin the third place playoff between the loser of those two. And curiously enough, you remember the last time we did, we did this, before we had the draw with Belgium, uh, France, uh, Spain, Italy, I think in that order, or it Italy, Spain, I uh, don't know it now 100%. However, due to the draw, the way it happened, Italy is now the favorite, but only barely. And thanks to home, home, home advantage, they have a 27% chance of winning it all. Then Belgium 25 and France and Spain 24%. It's all due to the draw. Italy would be the lowest ranked uh, nation, but due to the home field advantage. They hold the advantage there. And yeah, we would expect Italy to at least get to the final, but you never know. You never know in those matches. I'm actually quite quite excited that they play in Milan and that this is where they decide to play it and then also Turin. I think that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's it for the Nations League draw. Let me know how you think the draw went. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And yes, I'm wearing my first ever soccer jersey. Gets a rare outing. And yeah, subscribe to my channel if you see more videos like these and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel because it will keep you updated whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye.